In this video we're going to look at how to put in a button into our GUI using tkinter and also how we can use that button to call a uh, function. So uh, just to begin with I've got a basic um, program here that just runs and it sticks up a GUI window and if we just look at the code that I've got here just zoom in a little bit you can see we've set up um, the root window with the title, we've made it uh, not resizable and we've given it a, uh, a dimensions of 500 by 400. So we're just going to um, stick a button inside that root window and so I'm just going to call it uh, hello button because we're just going to make this say hello and because we're creating this as an instance of a class we're going to say button because that's the class and the first parameter is its location so we're just going to put that into the root there and one of the um, attributes we can have of this is the text that displays on it. So I'm just going to have text on my button that says, say hello. And I'll just stop there. And I'm just going to pack that in to our display, into our GUI. And just test that to make sure that the button appears. And there it is. So when we click on it, you can see it reacting. And obviously nothing is happening right now. Okay, so uh, what we're going to do is we're going to create a function that just prints out the words hello world in our output um, and then we're going to um, set a command for this button so that we'll call that function. So at the top of my program I'm just going to create a function called say hello and I'm just going to have it print hello world. And to call this function, what we do is we come back down to our hello button, there's our button object, and another attribute is command. And all we do here is we have the name of the function. Now we don't need the, the brackets after it like we normally would, we just literally have the name of the function. So when I run this now, when I click on the button, it should execute this command, which is calling the function, and the words hello world should be printed out in our output. go there's our button when we click on this you can see down the bottom there hello world is appearing every time I click on it and really that is buttons um, obviously there are other things you can do with them you, there are other attributes you can set background colors if you want if I might want to make it a, a bright red background color I could just set BG as my background and eventually there it is a bright red hello world button so you can tinker around with some of that stuff. I think uh, foreground color might be the uh, the text color. Let's see if I can get some yellow text there. Whoops. Yeah, so now we've got um, yellow, which is the foreground text, on a red background. And again, every time we click this, it is calling the say hello function. So that is a basic introduction into using buttons in TKinter. 